It's good. I really like you guys' work. It's cool. It's like like independent and like still underground kind of. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Like you gotta really search for it and do your research to find it. And like I'm like a really big I'm just as much of a skateboard fan as I am, like an actual skateboarder. Yeah. So I really like to like, you know, search and learn and like find the stuff. So yeah. and I found you guys. So it's cool just, you know, go around all these things, especially the community. Hearing you guys are, you know, coming up from yeah. the board. Like whatever is like sort of hour happening positive skateboarding like you know, in Southern California, like you guys take the initiative to go out. It's yeah. so cool that like, you do that. Right? And, and we do it all for free. Yeah, yeah that's cool. I know, like it's just we were going we were gonna be at these events anyway, you know, so yeah. might as well film and you know have a good time. Yeah. yeah. Really uh, could you tell us something about this video that we're watching? Um, I'm actually going to give like, an introduction before I play it. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. you guys are welcome to film that. Yeah. yeah, we always like to film those opening ceremonies type of thing. Yeah, because, I'm going to uh, talk for like a minute or two, just give a little introduction. And then we're going to play it. But yeah, it's just, um, nobody has watched it yet. It's like only me. Oh, I edited so every second of it. Yeah, uh, are you selling like a uh, DVD copy? Not today. They're going to be available. Um, I really like, um, I like the Ronnie Mullen one. Yeah. <laughs> Just because, like, he's like the most low key dude ever. Like, he's very private in his personal life. And, like, like I don't even know what his, like, what his wife looked like or anything. Like, he's very, like, to himself. And, yeah. Like, I don't know. I watched his, like, Daniel Life on Formula One and stuff, where he's, like, working and stuff. But, like, yeah. that's all I've really seen of him. And I think that's really cool that like, you went to like the globe thing and you like talked to Chris, uh, Haslam and like you saw him at the, the Venice event too. Oh, like, with, I, and, with, uh, and he's all like, oh, I remember you guys. Yeah. Yeah, and you guys interviewed Issy. Oh, yeah. yeah. I know yeah. Issy. I've skated with him before. Oh, sweet. Yeah. 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 Uh, and Issy knows us. And yeah. And like, oh, shit, because we saw him a bunch of times on YouTube and stuff. Yeah. yeah. Issy's tight. He's a really cool dude. He's coming up a lot. Yeah. yeah. I can't wait till like, his footage comes out for like, all those. Yeah, and, um, I hope uh, in terms I, of him, yeah. he deserves it, dude. Oh, definitely. Like, he switched up like a 14 or something like that. That's crazy. And then, um, I was, I'm friends with him on Facebook. And he just got over 5,000 um, friends on his thing, so he had to create like a fan page yeah. because he can't friend any more people. Yeah, yeah. Facebook allows you to do 5,000. Yeah, I think it's crazy. Yeah, yeah. it's just cool. He's like such a positive dude. He's, he reminds me of kind of like Diotis. Like, he's like oh, yes, super yeah. nice, super polite. And those are the people that he has to root for. Oh, yeah, yeah. and I definitely. Like, he loves skateboarding, he loves what he does. And I think it's the whole story behind how he met Day One, like just skating like in like that area, like over by. <laughs> Like San Pedro and stuff, like just bumping into him at spots and stuff, like I think that's super sick. And like he wasn't really trying to do that; it just kind of happened naturally. Like, oh, so so you gotta work for those dudes. Yeah, you know? definitely. And seriously, kind of like with us, like we never planned on this to happen because we came here for college, but we remembered, oh yeah, there's events happening, so we should go check one out. Oh, yeah, and then like we the, just kept doing it. We as a skateboard mecca, like Southern California, like everything happens here. Yeah, because like we uh, we come from uh, we're set up north. We were always skateboarding. We're into skateboarding, and when we came down here. We just thought, all right, we get to skate a bunch of parks they have everywhere, you know. Yeah, and they so, have the best yeah, and so yeah, and we never thought, oh, we could actually accomplish something in the skate or you know, or uh, help uh, generate or provide, you know, yeah, more motivation. No, I like what you guys do. Like, I'm a big fan. I think it's really cool. Like, you guys are doing something good, and like, there's no one else. Like out there that really does stuff like that. It takes that initiative to go out there on their own, like unpaid. And you guys just love skateboarding and love meeting people. And yeah, I know. You want to share that with people, and that's what's up. You know, that's what skateboarding is about. I know. Sharing your passion with people. Yeah, I just wanted to introduce myself. I'm Robert Prado, and the founding owner of Epiphany Skateboards. I started this company in uh, April of 2010, and. Um, I don't know, this is pretty much like my big job. I do everything like that you see like on the website, on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube. Uh, I design some of the board graphics. I'm on the phone calling shops, like telling them to, you know, order product and uh, I don't know. I pretty much do everything by myself. And, uh, to see all you people here tonight it really means a lot to me, the rest of the team, the people that help film. And uh, what are their names, Robert? But, uh, to tell you a little bit about the video, I want to give you a little bit of introduction. We uh, only worked on the video for 10 months, and it's kind of a, I don't know, we just worked on it for 10 months. We filmed it mainly around here, and uh... <laughs> 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 
<laughs> but yeah, like I had a goal to, to make a film within a year. I didn't want to spend like three years or something like that on working on a video, so. <laughs> We found it a pretty short time frame, and uh, I don't know, I can speak for everybody when I say that this is probably the funnest video that we've ever worked on. Like, I don't need that. He doesn't need it. Robert, fucking <laughs> take it. Take it, man. Take it. This is the funnest video that we've ever, like, worked on as a team, and, like, it was really fun. We, like, you know, we got it done within a short time frame, so, like, I'm really happy with, like, what everybody did, and uh, I'm, I'm the only one that's watched the video. I never let anybody else on the team watch it, so it's actually their first time watching it too. So it's everyone's first time, and uh, I don't know. Silence yeah. your cell phones. Turn that shit down, please. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Shut up. Yeah. Shut up. Yeah. What's up, guys? What up, Jay? What up, Jay? Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, guys. I, I appreciate you guys coming through. This premiere is gonna be sick. Um, we got Taylor Gang in the house. These guys are dope. Trey Biggity right here, man. We got a complete the same before we even started. My dude. Taylor! Where's Wiz? Where's Wiz? Where's Wiz? Shout out to this whole event that's going on. This is really like the community coming together to do something. Yeah, that's real shit. Woo! Thanks for inviting us. Thanks for coming. Oh, you got e all day. Get Bethany skateboards. Yeah.